Hello, I'm Ella Amp. This is my channel, and I got a package in the mail today. So yes, as I'm sure you can tell by the title, I got the Jeffree Star Bloodlust palette in the mail today, and I've already been playing with it, and I was going to record myself doing a look, and kind of forgot. <laughs> so if you're actually interested in seeing some kind of a look, or a look maybe using certain colors, leave a comment below, and I might possibly do that if you're interested. Otherwise, it is... And it is absolutely stunning in person. The velvet with the little metal logo on the front, the clasp, and then the plastic inside, and it is a thick piece of plastic. Now, a lot of people, I guess, complain because they wanted the plastic to protect the eyeshadows, and then some people are complaining because of the environment. But honestly, if you're environment conscious, if you were to wipe it off and sterilize it with alcohol, you could use it as a, um, like, like a mixing mirror, or mixing tray for eyeshadow, wet eyeshadows, or for foundations or anything like that or if you're an artist you could use it as a paint palette so I mean there are ways to reuse this little piece of plastic if you are concerned about it so and then the eyeshadows and I will insert a picture I did some swatches and I will insert that and I also got, because I was going to get the, um, oh, what was it? The lipstick bundle, but I decided not to because I didn't know if I'd wear the colors. Kind of wish I would have, but that's okay. But I did pick up a lipstick because I looked and tried to get a, I ordered from Beautylish, so I looked at what they had available and looked for something purple. And I ended up getting, comes in this box, and it is the shade Sagittarius. So, it looks like this. And it's what I have on my lips, and I have the, from his Valentine's Day mystery box, I have succulent, kind of a little bit on top towards the center. And I did only use the Jeffree Star, the Bloodlust palette for my look today. So, and my hair's still wet from the shower. Not sure if I'm liking it or not, but that's what I came up with. I used the shades for my base shades. I used Your Majesty on the top part and monarchy kind of towards the bottom and then I use for the darkest color the darkest purple in the crease kind of coming to the outside I use dungeon and then for the very very outside I put just a dot of executioner and kind of brought it up and out to kind of um, deepen up dungeon a little bit and on my lids towards the outside I have high king and in the middle, I have Deviant, and on top of Deviant, I have Take the Crown with just a touch of pink magic. And right underneath here, this pink color you see is royal pink with mixed with a little bit of Betrayal. And I put on the outside and kind of blended it in with Dungeon is Vivid Mood, just to kind of give you guys an idea. And I did use a purple eyeliner 
uh, liquid eyeliner. It was just a NYX, one of the NYX Vivid. So, and on the bottom lid, I used Scandal Water mixed with a little bit of Vile Serpent. And I kind of didn't like how that looked. So I ended up mixing a little bit of um, Blood Queen in with it. And then for my inner corners and a little bit kind of under my eyebrow, I used Beauty Sleep. So. But like I said, if you would like me to do a look or if you're maybe interested in seeing a look using certain colors, um, you know, let me know in the comments below and I'll see what I can do. And that's pretty much it for this video. It's just a short video. I kind of figured it would be. So you guys have a great day. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. And if you're new here, please consider hitting that little subscribe button, ringing the bell, so you get notified every time I upload. And I'll see you guys next time.